what's going on everybody welcome back if you are new feel free to hit the subscribe button down below this is the 15th episode of the realistic player career mode enough time wasted i'm gonna jump right into this match here against nottingham forest and i'll see everybody out there on the pitch and here we are it is that time i feel like doing the seven passes let me turn this down a bit i feel like doing the seven passes in the opposition's grounds will be the easiest task to do you know we might not win this match today given our standing in the premier league we haven't really been playing up to the standard that we could be at. And honestly, it's a bit disappointing, but I mean, I'm on Middlesbrough. I'm not really expecting to win any matches. Well, any more than the bottom team, let's just say. Because right now where we're sitting, a good touch from Jesus already. And on a run, good step over move and a beautiful pass. One more, finish. There it goes, getting started early. I did say I was not expecting to get this win today. But right now against Forest, it's looking pretty good for our chances of getting that victory, which will allow us to win the game with skill and patience. But a quick pass inside. And another one, Ilanga. And wait a minute. Mina gets the ball off to Jesus. And here we go. Running of the Bulls now. Middlesbrough, good pass up. Azad to Romans. Fry on a run and a good touch. Looking for the play here. Good through ball. What a touch, Mina. Needing a good cross, beautiful touch. Oh, Latte Lan! Oh, worldy, worldy. Run it back. Look at the cross in. Emmanuel Latte Lan leans back and shows everybody exactly what he's made of. That's what he's been holding in all season long. And it's about that time that we bring it out, the man. Come on. Latte Lan with a great bicycle kick. Was not expecting the bicicleta. And that's exactly what you need to see. 2-0 on the day and looking for the 3-0. Looks like Man City might have got scored on. Or not. Bournemouth. 2-0 in that match. Hopefully they lose. Ilanga. Quick one. You know, that's not exactly what you want to see. I know defensively we have a lot of things to work on. That's why I'm looking to go to Milan, to be honest. I know at least there they have defensive focus. But here, come on. Quick pass, just too slow to get over there. And I mean, that's exactly what happens when your keeper and your center backs aren't on the same page. Ball a quick one, Ilanga. <laughs> it's so crazy. You think that you have a chance of winning this match and they humble us every single time within the last minutes of the match or of the half. Here we have a quick pass inside. Connor Gallagher looking man, 36, moves it over to Ilanga. Already has an assist and a goal. Looking for the soft hat trick today. Who knows if he'll get it done. I hope not, because that is our chances of winning this match. Clean out the window if he does. Nine passes alone from Jesus Fabianski made today. Looking for greatness. Good ball in, and there it is away. Latte Laf, good touch to Jesus. And I gotta run with this one. I see who's pressing me, I see who's not. And I'm gonna start running at this man. Here we go, it could be a goal. Could be a goal if he runs all the way. Jesus looking for the shot. Oh, how? You get the freebies, I swear. And they just don't go our way. Jesus Fabianski on the cross. Looks good. Could not be played though, and it might be out. I'm looking for the cross here. Oh, Latte Laf once again. My left foot cross is much more dominant than the right foot. We know I have a one star weak foot, and honestly, I put it that low because I thought it would be easier to upgrade it, but I might be a, a one-star weak foot for seasons and seasons to come because it doesn't look like I'm going to have any improvement on that. In that, oh, field, so to speak. Quick movements already. And Warney, a quick cross and a header. Ooh, I think that was Danilo on Roberts in net. A very close shot, no replay, but a very close effort for sure. And Forrest coming in, we know he has a goal on the season, I'm pretty sure. And a quick pass now, and of course, good save. Romez gets it off the line. Close, close, close call. And now here it goes. Quick touch now, number seven looking for the play, and a good touch from Force. I told you he was a beast. And Jesus Fabianski could score this one. Loses the man. Walling him off. Oh, why not just go to goal? Why not just go to goal? Ilanga. That could have been our opportunity right there. It could have just slipped out our hands. And it could be all over here. I'm looking for the victory, but still undetermined on whose it is. We shall see and we shall find out. Zinkovic, quick touch, maybe looking for a quick pass. 93 minutes played, only two minutes allowed for extra time. 
They will play on until the ball is dead. And here it is, a cross in. And it's over. Wait a minute, though. A foul call. And it could be right here that spells disaster. We've been looking for some points. And of course, you expect to have the victory at heart, have it in the bag. But it looks like every time we come out here, it's a sad result. Middlesbrough picking up another loss, a horrid defeat. It was back and forth all match, and that's the way it ends for us. Putting us right back down to the floor, two on one. Look at number six, the Capitan not guarding anybody on that play. Abysmal defense is going to get you abysmal results. And there we are again. Another loss. So everyone, I'll see you all in the next match, hopefully, with the victory. A bit of a surprise here. The Emirates FA Cup. There is still one piece of silverware we can win as a club. And best believe I'm going to go out here and try my hardest to accomplish that. Here we are facing against Wrexham. I mean, a lot of people in the world, especially here in America, know about pe the people that own Wrexham now. I'm pretty sure it's um Ryan, Ryan, not Ryan Gosling. Is that his name? It might be. I'm not sure exactly what his name, but I know it's an actor and I think one of his friends. Oh, quick touch. Hey, Seuss. Looking for the goal. Hey, 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 but you see the work though. You see the work in place and already making good moves to the net, Jesus Fabianski. The cross looked good though, I'm not gonna lie. That might be one of my crosses I have to go to. Just run up the pitch, cut back, and then use my left foot to cross it in. And a quick run, counterattack in football now. Wow, bro. Of course, in the Emirates FA Cup, it is disaster time. Look at Jesus, look at the pace, foul! <laughs> Mendy, and he doesn't make the pass, thank the Lord. Fry, Roman's inside. Silvera, a whole bunch of new names. I haven't seen these guys just yet. Uh, wow, I tried it. Hey, I'm gonna be aggressive on the ball for sure. Every opportunity I see is a chance to get that ball back. Quick turn for Mullen now, looking for the goal. And we will find out exactly if they'll get it. Up one nil on us. And there it is, Silvera, good play to the middle. Emmanuel, can he get that off his back? Wow, quick pass on the pitch. Another one, a good touch, good touch. Emmanuel, all the way! Good block though, man, by the CB. Dang, that was our one chance right there to really get a good opportunity and tie it up even Steven at one apiece. I'm not sure how to feel going into the second half, but I know Jesus Fabianski will have to take over. There is no match replay in the first round, so if we draw, we'll be going to extra time. Mm, I'm trying to get that Travella off, but it's a, that's a tough finish. Azaz, good touch. There it is. Housen, good movement. One more, Latte Love. Oh, almost a beautiful strike into the top left corner. Maybe that was the top right, actually, excuse me. Top right bins, that would have been perfect. Would have been perfect. There we go, good movement, Mina. Looking for the play, Housen. Good touch. Gotta move it, gotta move it, Emmanuel. Wow. They get so fast, bro, they're so fast on the close down. I'm gonna have to run at them and allow them to make a mistake, like right here. Oh, no! No way! Too high, too much power. I haven't heard that yet from Fabianski. And that was not a good pass. Mendy has been all over the place today defensively, and he might just close himself down, maybe in a good defensive play for McNair. But Giovanni comes right back, and look at Mendy trying to make the play, but on Jesus, no way. I'm here all day. I'm ready to play, and I'm looking for this victory. I gotta get back to my wing. But I mean, I might, we might overload the left. We've seen plenty of goals come from this type of situation. Emmanuel, good run. Good run, five minutes left to play. This could be our last chance. Uh, not the best cross. If anything, it's now. If you want to be a hero, it's now. 89 minutes played. And look at this man. That's game. It's game over. Game over. Well, so much for the FA Cup. At least now we won't have to prolong the season. And keep waiting on for something that's not gonna come. It's just a bit disappointing, actually it's a lot disappointing to know that the Carabao Cup, the Premier League, and the FA Cup, nowhere in sight for us right now to win. And 
I mean, the Premier League is the only thing that we have right now to really, really push forward and look for that victory. So, hopefully in our next match, we will be victorious. I mean, a sickening loss today, obviously. We're looking to bounce back, though, in our last match of the episode. I'll see everyone when it's time. What's going on, everybody? We are here with our last showing of Jesus Fabianski. I'm excited. I'm not really sure what to expect like every other match, of course. But we're coming out looking for the victory today. And hopefully, we can pick that up. We will see, though, exactly what's in store for us and if it holds the victory. Now, I hope it does. But, of course, no promises. Because if you promise something and you can't complete it 100%, you shouldn't make it a promise. Because you don't know the result out here in this football match. Good touch, Azaz. Back in the middle of the lap. Good push, good push. He's going to hit me. Maybe. He try. He gave it a go. Oh, looking for an, a courageous kind of bending in shot to that near post. It was going to be tough to hit, but I mean, anybody has a good chance of doing this. Jesus Fabianski. Offside, Azaz. Come on, watch up. You got to watch that. Who is this? Looks like Sousa for number 33 on Middlesbrough. It's going to be a debut today. So we shall see if he really has the skills or if he's just out here trying to make it. Slide by. So far, I haven't seen anything from Silva. I mean, Sousa, excuse me. I'm not really sure if he's lined up on the pitch. Could be a midfielder, left back type. But we shall see. Good play, Dioff. Azaz. Latelaf. Look at Wolves versus Chelsea. Good match. Engel. I'm going to move it to the middle. Ah. What a finish! Oh, what a save! Pretty sure that was a pretty good uh, a save there. I got a hand on it. He did, the keeper. I thought um, Latte Love just absolutely demolished him. Oh, and Jesus battle. He was about to pull out the moves. Hold on, y'all. I'll be forgetting I got dribbles. Whoa, cheeky! I really tried catching him off guard there. I wanted to do a fake shot, but it looks like I was committed to the goal there. Sinistera. I'm not seeing about, I'm not seeing the debut anywhere. Oh, it's the keeper. They signed the new keeper. Okay, you know what? We might have made a actually good move for once I've seen in this career mode. Look at that. Sosa, he ain't going for nothing. Next match, I could tell in the next episode, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be a, a strong episode, because look at Sosa make it a play and can he throw it down the pitch and that is the half in the books all right nil nil at the half this is actually a really good position to be in for us because usually we're down so hopefully we can get this win and get up out of here with the victory i'm telling you jesus fabianski just a bit more agility he could cut right through there like messi and get the goal. That's what I'm looking to do. Neymar, Messi-esque. A Brazilian Messi. If that makes sense. Wow. Sule to Spurs. Exactly when I praise the keeper for all the hard work he's been doing. The second half almost defeats the whole first. Comes right down there and scores a goal on us. Dalinga. Maybe Dalinga. I'm not sure exactly if it's uh, Hispanic or Spanish or whatever. But wow, just a quick shot, right top right bins, nothing hard, pretty easy. And what it was right there was the fullbacks and the center backs, actually, the defense. When the defense isn't there, you have no chance of stopping that goal. Can't really do nothing about it. So we'll just keep prevailing forward, keep trying to win the match. That's what I'm saying. They gonna call that a PK. Let's see that ref. Maybe, maybe, but thank you. Let's go, Sousa. He tried to panenka us. That's ultimate disrespect, fellas. I hope y'all all know that. Damn! Face full of grass, bro. Mm -mm -mm. And looks like Jesus Fabianski was dispatched from the pitch pretty quick. Had about five minutes left to play. The gaffer didn't want to see him out there anymore. So let's see if making a sub, obviously not, was going to change anything. So, everybody, I will see you all back at the main menu for the episode recap. 
and some updates. And here we are, once again, look at Jesus Fabianski, top 15 in the Premier League for scorers. Nine goals in 20 matches, not the best, not the worst, but look at him, top 10 in assists, only two behind the likes of Grealish, Acuna, and Kevin De Bruyne. Doing pretty good, I must say, for being 18 years young in the Premier League, coming from SC Freiburg too. But I wanna see right now exactly how we're looking as a squad. Overall wise, he's at 83, which I think is a perfect overall to go and hit uh, Milan. I'm, I don't wanna do too much more upgrading. So I'm gonna look pretty much what can make him better, what won't make him better, and I'm gonna start focusing on those upgrades just to kinda build him all around before he gets to Milan. So he'll be really ready to go, hit the ground running. But here we go, 11 goals, six assists, three clean sheets as a crew with 23 appearances. Now I'm not really sure what the next episode has in store, but I know it's gonna be a great one. So if you enjoyed this episode, drop a like down below, subscribe for more uploads just like this, and everybody stay safe out there. Peace out everybody. It was Frank on the pitch with Jesus Fabianski. Take it easy.